The Department of Homeland Security is a federal agency that you may not be paying attention to. But over the last several years, it's been at the center of a lot of controversy. From Secret Service agents roughly clearing BLM protesters in D.C. To the crisis at our southern border. One agent was caught on camera swinging his horse strap at one of the migrants. To January 6th. It's a powerful agency. But what happens when the people inside it abuse their power? And what happens when the watchdog, tasked with exposing those abuses, chooses to look the other way? This is the guy running the watchdog shop, but he doesn't want to raise red flags when clearly they're warranted. President Trump was firing inspectors general left and right if they displeased him. There's enough smoke here to to know that there's a fire burning somewhere. How the hell am I going to be a Border Patrol agent if I can't protect myself? And I can't do this anymore. I said, I don't even believe in what we do anymore. The people I arrest are less criminals than the guys I'm sitting next to. Joseph Kafari is giving cover to abusive agents within the ranks. All of these people said that when they reported things, it was detrimental to their career. I mean, this is the story of an agency. This is a podcast about finding the truth and holding people accountable, which is essentially, and not coincidentally, the work of an inspector general. I'm Marin Macklis, and from the Project on Government Oversight, This is Bad Watchdog, a new six-part investigative series launching Thursday, January 26th. Listen and follow wherever you get your podcasts.